Hey, hey, everyone, and uh, welcome in or welcome back. It's a monkey mar. Before we get into this video, please make sure you click that subscribe button, the bell for notifications, and of course, the like. All right, in this video, we are going just to do a quick update on the Briasia Terrell march that went on this past weekend, and her mom was out there. So, let's get into it let's get into it quick so I can get this out here because we know I get sidetracked and next thing you know mother of missing Brie Asia Terrell joins March and she wants answers Davenport Iowa the family of missing 10 year old Brie Asia Terrell is still looking for answers four months after she disappeared family friends and other gathered Saturday Davenport, Iowa. The family of missing 10-year-old Briasia Terrell is still looking for answers four months after she disappeared. Family, friends, and others gathered Saturday at the Davenport apartment complex where Briasia was last seen on the night of July 9th of 2020. Briasia's mother, relatives, and others say they formed Saturday's march to raise awareness Briasia is still missing, and they are thankful for the support from the community. I definitely appreciate them out here, taking the time and the effort, said Aisha Langford, Briasia's mother. With the t-shirts, the hats, the posters, we definitely standing with them. The rainy Saturday followed by a dreary Sunday was part of two days of marching to find answers in Briasia's disappearance. Family, friends, and supporters gathered at Vanderveer Park in Davenport Sunday afternoon. It's been a hundred and twenty seven days, Langford said. The two marches over the weekend included gathering on busy street corners throughout Davenport, holding signs and pictures and passing out flyers. All of this is with the hope someone knows something that can bring Briasia home. Langford returned to the Davenport apartment complex Saturday and said she was nervous about that experience. I mean, my stomach, it definitely kind of bubbled a little bit, Langford said. I mean, to come back to this place after 127 days, it's definitely rough. But I'm here because the community gathered together. But Langford said she is grateful for the community's continued support. Davenport police have named Henry Dinkins the person of interest in the case, but so far no one has been charged in the disappearance. Briasia will turn 11 years old next month. I am going to attach the link to the video if you want to watch it in the description. And let's remember who Henry Earls Dinkin is. Remember him driving this lovely van around? He knows where Briasia Terrell is and why he is not talking Something is just off. Asia Langford, I wish you would email me and I will give you my phone number. I would love to talk to you and maybe somehow we can gather and get a Facebook group going for Briasia. And people need to get out there and keep the awareness going for her because where is she? Where is this 10 year old little girl? I'm going to start digging some more. You know, I've looked in the area and the sexual predators that live in the area, but I'm sure the police have already covered this. Henry Earl Dinkins, you need to tell them where this little girl is. Her birthday's coming, and it's just... I don't know. Something doesn't sit right with me. All right, guys, make sure you drop them opinions, comments, and with that, it is a wrap. I want to thank you all for coming in. Thank you for watching. Please like or dislike, whichever you prefer, and subscribe. Everyone have a good day or a good night wherever you are in the world, and stay vigilant. I am out.